Welcome back. I will show you how to make tapache. This is a Mexican drink made from fermented pineapple peel. So you can also call it fermented pineapple drink, wine, beer. Please stay tuned. This is a homemade pineapple beer or pineapple wine or fermented pineapple drink. You will need pineapple and we are going to be making use of the pineapple peel and you need to wash the pineapple peel properly to remove any date or to avoid contaminating the drink. I like to wash my pineapple to avoid contaminating the drink. So I've already washed the pineapple with brush. So I'm going to add bicarbonate soda and vinegar. Then I will dip the pineapple to sit for about 10 minutes, then wash it again, scrub it, then rinse again with clean water before I can now peel to get the pineapple peel. Fermented pineapple drink is a simple drink that you can make with just three basic ingredients like the pineapple peel, brown sugar and water. You can decide to add any spice of your choice. So when I'm done peeling the pineapple, I will set aside the pineapple peel. So I'm going to cut the pineapple peel into smaller pieces so that I can enter the jar that I'm using. So when I'm done cutting the pineapple peel, I will set aside. Here I have my clean wash jar. I'm going to add brown sugar. This is about five tablespoons of brown sugar. You can decide to use white sugar. I also add black pepper and clove seed. I'll also be adding cinnamon stick. Feel free to add any spice of your choice. Then I'm going to add water. Stay so that the sugar can dissolve properly before I will add the pineapple peel. Notice that the sugar have dissolved properly. I will start by adding the pineapple peel. Make sure that the water covers the pineapple peel. Then cover it to protect it from insects or particles. Avoid covering it so tightly so that carbon dioxide can escape during the fermentation process. Then leave it to sit for about three days or more. After about three days, you will notice the bubble and the foam on top. This shows that the yeast is alive and it is producing the carbon dioxide and alcohol. So I'm going to scoop out the foam on top. This is optional and I don't want to ferment this for a long time because the longer that you ferment this, the more alcohol and less sweet it will be. So when I'm done, I'm going to strain to get the drink. After straining it, you can decide to let it undergo second fermentation by storing it in a container and you leave it in a room temperature to ferment for about two or four days more. Finally, the homemade tapache is ready. You can enjoy this fermented pineapple drink it is so refreshing. This homemade fermented pineapple beer or wine is so easy to make. You just need three basic ingredients to make this and it's so cheap to make. I hope that this video is helpful.